Illinois State Police blame one driver for causing a crash involving four tractor trailers shutting down Interstate 57 for hours. Troopers say one of the semis did not slow down for the construction zone near the I-24 split yesterday and slammed into those three other trucks. As News 3's Brandon Morano shows us, it's got those who cleared up that mess stressing safe driving. Employees at Vernell's Towing see a lot of wrecks. Vernell's, this is Matt. Cleaning up the crash involving four semis Thursday was a big job for Matthew Longmire's crew. I've been here with Vernell's for about three years. It's probably one of the biggest ones I've seen. Illinois State Police say a trailing semi carrying bananas didn't slow down for construction and slammed into three other semis, causing the fiery crash. I mean, I don't know if he wasn't paying attention or what the deal was, but it caused a bitty, or pretty big wreck. A pretty big wreck that had all northbound lanes of Interstate 57 shut down for nearly six hours. Fellow truck driver Stephen Whitehurst is just glad everyone made it out alive. You see that all the time, and sometimes you just get lucky. Whitehurst says he hopes the driver of this truck and all other truck drivers learn the lesson to slow down and pay attention. You just be safe. Uh, just watch that following distance. Those working the scene just want to make sure everyone else slows down while they clear the way. A couple years ago, we had one of our drivers get hit because of stuff like that. Something Longmire doesn't want to see happen again. In Johnson County, Brandon Murano, News 3. Now the driver of that semi blamed for the crash was ticketed for failure to reduce speed to avoid an accident and following too closely.